So yesterday, I got a new arrival notification from BET Plus about all the Queen's men. I'm already four episodes in, and all I can say is, all hail this queen, because she does not play. All right, fellas. It's game time. Excuse me. There are no photos allowed. Y'all crazy. What is your name? Keisha. My nose is bleeding. Keisha, my nose is bleeding. It's no longer allowed in my establishment. Well, we told you from the new BT Plus drama, All the Queen's Men, we have some serious multi-hyphenate guests in the house. First, entrepreneur, mo model, actress, and TV host, Miss Eva Marcel. Then we have actor, author, singer, writer, and producer, Mr. Christian Keys. Good morning, Eva and Christian. Good morning. Hi. Good morning. All right, so haven't seen the first four episodes. I would like to clarify that I pledge allegiance to Madam. The concierge, on the other hand, cannot be trusted in my book, at least not yet. Would you not agree, Eva? Um, I don't think that it's that he can't be trusted. It's that there's too much mystique behind him. And I'm a woman that knows what's going on in my city. Uh -huh. And the fact that he is a little bit of a mystery to me is very irritating. All right, that's why I said not yet. He cannot be trusted yet. Yeah. I gave him that benefit. All right, yeah. so, so no. Christian, I know you're, you're trying to make a case for concierge, yeah. but this series is based on your book, Ladies' Night. And you wear many, many hats on this series, which takes yes, us into the world of male exotic dancers. And there's a warning before each episode. Thank you for that warning, by the way. I don't pe think people are ready for what's about to hit them. So please prepare us a little bit for those who haven't seen it yet. Absolutely, yes. Please let your sister or your, your uncle or somebody watch the kids. <laughs> um, this isn't your, your granny's TV show, mm -mm. but it's witty, it's sexy, it's dramatic, it is beautiful, it is urban, it's melanated, it is everything you didn't even know that you needed. So get ready, put your seatbelt on, and let's go. Oh, I think I got, I had my seatbelt, I had everything on, because the first, I was like, whoa, okay. All right, so Eva... <laughs> Although the show is titled All the Queen's Men, you do have some super women in your crew from Blue to Dime, and I'm hoping Trouble, because I like her. And that dynamic really makes me happy. Yes, I think it is really refreshing to see women in such a lead role, not just a leading lady, but a powerful role. Mm -hmm. Roles that the men depend on us to take care of them, protect them, provide for them. And so it was really awesome working in a very different capacity as a leading lady. All right, so Christian, we don't get to see a lot of your character, the concierge, straight off the bat, especially in the first few episodes. I've seen a ton of pics of him, though. And I thought that, I, I, my first thinking when I saw like all those pictures was, what in the black James Bond is going on? I don't think I like him yet, but I think we will. I, I think we will too. I, I think we haven't established exactly where he's going and that's the fun in that. And I'm loving, and I feel like the concierge is loving the unapologetic femininity of it all, the whole world, the whole, the characters, Madam, Blue, Dime, everybody, just a celebration of unapologetic female amazingness, period. Okay, can I tell you, period, that I have never been to a real-life Eden, if you know what I mean? But after watching this show, I feel like I'm a regular customer because it does take you in. Like, the only difference is that there was no one there for me, for me to make it rain, which I, was, I wasn't making it rain. I probably wouldn't, but I'm just saying, like, it feels like I'm in, I, I've experienced the whole thing now. I don't even need to go to a real one now. Well, the thing is, is that if you do find yourself at any uh, male review, it won't be Eden because Eden is an experience in and of itself. Oh. And that's what's so juicy and delicious about our show is that it's not just about a nightclub. It's not just about dancers. These are artists and these mm -hmm. are business people that are taking their life to the next level. We're building an empire. And so Eden is merely a backdrop, but it is not something you will find at any other club. Oh, well, now that you've said it. Hey, Ben, I'm and somebody gonna... else said, somebody tweeted me yesterday. Mm-hmm. What did I'm they say? I'm sorry for cutting you off. No, somebody what did they tweeted say? me yesterday and said they Googled, they, they said they Googled Eden because they were trying to find <laughs> it. And, and they couldn't... <laughs> we knew they would do that. Now 
you <laughs> tried the GPS Club Eden and they couldn't find it. Now you have to create a real Eden for us because this is what you get when you have the likes of Christian Keys, Eva Marcel, Tyler Perry, Kim Fields, who's not only producing but has directed some of the episodes involved. Listen, I, I want to come work there too now, so you better figure it out. I'm sending my resume, whether you guys like it or not. And by the way, I don't but like Carla. You can come, but listen. We, no, no, no one likes Carla. But if you're going to come work, know to be on time, okay? I'm always, on time, always on time, I promise. I'm always on time. as long as you understand, well, then there we go. We uh, might have an in. Yay! We might have an in. Is Mr. Keys wearing a bathrobe? But Carla, Carla is that sister. Carla's that sister, that family member that, you know, even watching it yesterday, um, uh, I found myself finding those levels because I know my strength. Mm -hmm. I know my capabilities, but this is also my sister, and we're talking about my father. Yeah. And so having to rein in my frustration and my rage uh, and not doing what I know I can do um, is very frustrating for Madam. It is very frustrating. Oh. And Carla is just... It was, she is so irritating. It was for me. The first time you were you went, we were supposed to meet her. I was like, you about to lose your job, Carla. And then I realized that she was your sister. I was like, all right, there she's complicating <laughs> things for people. Eva, Christian... Such a pleasure to meet the two of you. Everyone, if you have not started streaming all the Queens Men on BET Plus, seriously, do I have to come get you? Because I will. You don't want it. All right, thank you so much to the two of you. I cannot wait to catch up on the entire season and see more and more and more seasons to come. It's, 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 it's great entertainment, I have to say. Thank you. Dan, thank you. Go.